Okay, it's uh, Friday. I'm done shopping. And here are my pickups for the day. Uh, I think I spent about 103 on everything you see here. And of, I don't believe I, I found anything fantastic, whatever. Um, most stuff was cheap, though. So, um, I don't know. Here we go. A box. And what I, uh, there's a bunch of CDs in this holder. It's just a mix. Some's good, some's junk. Um, but I paid 25 for whatever's in this box. And it's, it's not really, you know, Lionel Richie. I don't know. Just stuff. Um, so 25 for that. Uh, at the same place, I paid 50 for this bag. And there was a bunch of loose CDs in here. And uh, some other CDs. I took this out of the box. Um, as you see, this one is... Uh, bootleg but there's tons of regular ones in here and I'm just gonna take a book and put them in the book and, and we'll do it this way um, in the bag there are also and I don't think there's any more but I'm gonna go through them later there was a bunch of games and let me just put this down for a second okay <laughs> I'm back um, I got a bunch of loose PS1 games this is probably the most valuable of the game Crash Team Racing and I don't I'm not from oh, Destruction Derby Ridge Racer, You Don't Know Jack, CD1, um, MLB 98, Game Day 99, Arcade Party Pack, not familiar with that one, uh, Hardball 5, Sim Theme Park, not a valuable game, Cool Borders. These games I will put in a binder that I have, and I'm just going to make them like uh, $4, 2 for 7 3 for 10 but I'll sell them for a couple of bucks if you know somebody is really into them. Gallop Racer, uh, Twisted Metal 3. Porsche Challenge, uh, get a Road Rash, NASCAR 2001. So basically I paid $10 for this pile and $40 for the contents of the bag. And it's it's a fine deal, uh, although these will be slow sellers. Uh, NHL 99. Uh, apparently he was buying games in 99. March Madness 99, Andretti Racing. Um, Burning Road. Formula 98. Uh, Powerboat Racing. Grand Tour Racing. Oh, and then at a different sale, I got a couple of Wii games. What's this? Oh, and then there's this one. Uh, what is it? Need for Speed 3. Okay, and then another sale, I got some loose discs, but they're a little scuffed up. I'm going to have to check them to see if they're good. I'll polish them or whatever. Just Dance 4. Uh, Raymond Raving Rabbits. And then I got a, a Wii Mario Kart. And um, it looks dirty. It might clean up. I'm going to polish it, and I'll test it. If it's good, I believe I have a case for it. So, um, um, in terms of games... I got that's my main thing I got today those loose discs and then I got this is actually a sealed twisted metal four um, but as you can see the plastics um, coming undone a little bit and it's still technically sealed I'll put it in a sandwich or protect I might clean the plastic a little bit it looks a little dirty it was only a dollar so I mean and other than it being sealed I don't believe these that's uh, generally a very valuable game and then uh, mark seven offered five they said yes Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. I don't know. Maybe it's a $15 game. I, I can't remember everything. Um, then for a book a piece, I got these uh, DVDs. 50 Cent um, a Bulletproof Concert DVD. Reservoir Dogs. Blu-ray. Uh, Mickey's Twice Upon a Christmas. Oh, and I got a Jackie Martin Jokeman uh, CD. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, this was kind of a cool find. And I bought these bags for 50 cents. Uh, but this was a cool find. I just got a bunch of Pokemon um, zipper pulls. And um, I guess that's Squirtle, and obviously Pikachu, and uh, who's that? Zai something. Uh, okay, it doesn't say, but it doesn't matter. It looks like I got about three or four ones. That's probably Charizard. Uh, yeah, I think I think I got about four different ones, but mostly I got Pikachu's. Um, when I was looking at them, they informed me that someone had came and bought two full buckets of the stuff and uh, these were ones they just didn't get out so I bought their leftovers I probably got about like 20 of them there jewelry this is it today these stupid glass beaded necklace of no significant value all we paid a buck a piece we will probably sell them three dollars uh, I got I think this is an older transformer not really good with this stuff I tried to put it back together it was shaped something like a robot and I tried to make it back into a, a car and for me it's kind of like a Rubik's Cube I gave up when I got to here However I sell it, whoever sells it for me, they can deal with it. All right. Um, in terms of collectibles today, I got this nice little, nice little um, dog linen, and it's poodles. It's like a mama poodle and a baby poodles. I only paid a dollar. If I sell it from 5 to 
it's fine. Uh, it's it's not going to have any significant value unless the designer, which seems to be T A L blah whatever, is uh, a very valuable person, and I assume he is not. Then I got this Bizarro uh, duck that's uh, carved and painted. Uh, it looks like plastic eyes with this in it. I'm assuming it's some kind of holder of some sorts, maybe possibly for a remote control or I don't know, whatever might fit in there. Uh, no, I got one of these. These are cool. They're like speakers. If, uh, hopefully the battery's good. You can kind of sell these on eBay, maybe. They used to be able to for like 10 to 20, I think. I don't know. I'll find out about it. If I remember. Um, this is pretty cool. If this is a made in China, it won't have much value and I'll sell it at the flea market. Um, I can't tell right now. Uh, if it's a Murano uh, and a vintage one, then this could probably go. This is basically a Christmas tree paperweight. And... Um, on eBay, something like this might be worth um, 30 to 75 Not really sure. And my final find of the day was a Stradivarius. Oh, I'm sorry. It's a Dolce. <laughs> it's a Dolce um, No Re Musical Instrument Industrial Corp um, Beat Up Violin. Probably some kind of student violin. It does have a harp and uh, this, this box uh, that it came in. Um, I don't know what this word, you know, I'm assuming I'll get 20 to 50 for a BS violin at a flea market. Um, we will see. I normally don't get stuff like that, but it was only $2. Hey, how much a violin? $2. Okay, I'll take it. I'll, I'll figure out later on. Um, yep, that's it. That's everything. That's what I got today.